Hey friends, it's Bob with Kaler's Reptiles and Aquatics, and uh, I have a cold, so I've got a little deeper voice than usual, which I like. I'm doing a quick unboxing here. This is a little Motley Blue. Motley refers to the morph, the pattern, uh, corn snake. And uh, this is from BSR um, Auctions, which is uh, Miami Reptiles. And uh, I think it it's like $5.99 a month to belong to this. And they have frequent auctions. They send out, oh, 15, 20, 30 different auction items each day. And you have a couple of days to bid on things. And uh, I got this little girl for $131 or something like that. And uh, nice packing job here. Uh, they shipped overnight. They got here this morning, and uh, it's about uh, 12 hours later. I'm opening the box, so uh, knowing that uh, she was fine. That was a heating pad. It's still warm. This is what it looks like down there. And one thing about their packing job is their seams always meet up. I always look for that because if the seams don't meet, you've kind of wasted your time putting styrofoam in. And it did have a lid on it as well. Um, they did wrap it up rather than taping it to the top. Some people do it differently. All of that uh, brown wrapping paper was over the uh, top of the snake. So no way that that could have, the heat pad could have touched her. Uh, so let's take a look here at what we've got. She's an active little booger. And I'm going to put her in a little temporary container that I actually bought a uh, ball python in several months ago and it's sprayed there because I uh, put a little water, uh, distilled water, sprayed it on the uh, bedding and uh, given her some fresh water there in a bowl. So let's see here, female, blue motley, corn snake, and that's her call number there. So let's see if I can get this open with one hand without dropping her or um, spilling her or anything like that. And I won't take a whole lot of long time trying to do that. I'll just, there we go. I got her, I got her. I will, uh, she's ready to come out too. She is ready to come out. Milo the Chihuahua, here, let's just let you come out. I'm having trouble with that lid, so. Let's just let you slither on out there. Come on, little girl. And she is very blue. You can see the blue on her side there. Well, she came out a little bit. Ah, oh, there the lid's coming off a little more for me, and I might be able to lift her out. <coughs> Sorry about that. Hey, little pretty thing. Hey, little girl, look at you. What a beautiful little girl you are. Look how blue. The lighting in here is not that good. She's 14 inches, I believe the description said. You want to get in there? Get in there and get some water, maybe? There's plenty of moisture in here. So as long as she stays in there, I'll talk about her and look at her. Corn snakes are a great beginner snake, as uh, anybody that has snakes knows. They're a colubrid, colubrid. I say colubrid, it's the southern pronunciation. Looks like she's going to try to burrow under some of the bedding, which is fine. I'll put her a little hide in there, and I'm going to put her up on top of one of my bigger uh, habitats, that's a little corn snake there that I got from Sarah's, Sarah's snake shop and he's growing like gangbusters, but he's got water and a couple of little hides in there as well. So I find they do great sitting up on top of those. Um, when they get a little bigger, I want a bigger container and a warm hide and a cooler hide, but these little containers are great if they're sitting on top of a, heated um, 